Hi, I'm Walt with West Palm Dog, and today we're working with Apple on the go to bed command. So let's warm her up a few times, throw a piece of food. Apple, let's go. Go to bed. Yes, there we go. Help understand that this is where we want her to be. Now I'm going to work on the stay. So I'm going to back up a little bit. Stay. Two feet. Uh -huh. So she gets up. Put her right back where she was. Stay. Two steps. Yes. Three. Yes. Helping her to understand, regardless of where I go, how I move in the room, I want her to stay. There we go. Good. Stay. And so the distance that I'm working on is just the amount of time, like as far as duration goes, is only the amount of time it takes me to walk away from her and then return to her. Release, whenever I'm done with the exercise, I tap her on the head and say release. Apple, go to bed. Yes. Providing her time to think about that is so important. Yes. Stay. Now we're going to work on distraction. Opening the door. Yes. Good. Stay. Yes. <clears throat> Stay. And then we're also working on duration because she hasn't moved yet. types of stay. Distance, distraction, and duration. If she remains on the mat, she will continue to get treated. I want her to think that when this mat comes out, oh yes, I know exactly what I have to do. I just have to go on the mat, stay on the mat, and the food will rain down. Abba! Go to bed! Yes! Serious processing going on there. Now I'm going to grab this chair. Distraction. Stay. Yes. Very good. Start to click. And that's how we work on the stay. You have a good time? Huh, my girl? Huh? What? 